Hi, I'm Carl, and welcome to Adventures in Camping. Today, I'm going to show you how to sharpen an axe or hatchet or hunter's axe in the field without a vise. It's a safe way to do it, and you'd be surprised at how easy it is. Stick with me, and we'll get right to it. Oh, and if you want more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll be notified when I put out a new video. You will need four stakes to drive in Remember what I said about taking a little off of these corners so it doesn't split. Some of the materials that you will need to sharpen your axe or hatchet. One of them is an eight inch double-sided bastard file. If you don't have that, what is even better, for, especially for an axe or a hatchet, is one that's specifically designed for an axe or a hatchet. And that's what this one is. It even says axe on it. You will need a guard if it's available. If not, just use caution. You will also need a good sturdy pair of gloves that fit properly. Then you will need a double-sided puck style sharpening stone. These are more easily maneuvered up and down the blade. This one is soaked in water. You may also use one that uses oil. And I use olive oil with it. One thing that you should know, well, number one, I prefer to use water because it doesn't make other gear dirty. This one lives in this bag. It has been in that bag for years to keep it from making other things dirty. You're gonna to wanna to cut a log a little shorter than the ax that you're sharpening. Something for that ax to lean against. Then, you're going to need four stakes. Two in the front and two in the back. Do not pound your stakes in with that right there. Take in the back. Laying your file against the bit of the axe you're going to choose a 30 to 40 degree angle to file down the length of the bit. After you've made a few passes down one side, then flip it over and make a few passes on the other side. You're going to want to make the same number of passes on both sides. Next, apply the sharpening stone. Coarse side first, then fine side. Maintain the same angle as you used with the file. You're going to want several circular passes down each side of the blade. Flip the axe or hatchet over so that you can get the same number of passes down the bit. Once you feel that you have went down the bit enough on both sides, then you're going to want to check it for sharpness. Never run your finger down the bit to see if it's sharp. You can clean it off a little bit with your gloves down each side, but don't run your finger down the bit. Use a light to see if you can see a glint. That glint will indicate that you have a dull spot. 
then you can go back and work on it a little bit more. You can use the same procedure for sharpening a hatchet, but you're going to want another peg in the ground to hold the hatchet. Also, if they're a little closer, it would make it simpler. Once you finish sharpening with the file, then proceed to the stone. Start with the core side and then the fine side. Make the same number of passes on both sides. Also, remember to hold the bit away from you. Then, look for a glint with some available light on the bit and that'll tell you if it's sharp or not. Okay, there you go. That's how you can safely sharpen your ax or hatchet in camp without a vise. And remember, be ready and don't let circumstances remove you from the gene pool. Y'all come back now, you hear? Check out one of these other videos that I've posted. Remember, take your time, be safe.